your Seattle Sounders. They are looking to get back to that late season form that helped bring home the MLS Cup when they take on the Montreal Impact. And definitely there's still that little bit of a feel of, of, of how are Ladero and Dempsey going to find their touches in midfield again. Side of things for Montreal Impact. They have to make a change at the back. Cabrera comes in for Camara, but it's all about that front three. It's beyond Bernier. Very good skill. Two runners further forward. Excellent ball in behind Simon. It is Harry. Ship with the cross on that near post. An excellent run forward from Jordan Morris. The best move of the match so far. Almost results in the Sounders goal. He did just enough to clear the danger. Well, you got to get it right. You understand a little bit of a miscue, and so sim so simply you can put it in your own net. Piatti with a through ball. It's a lovely through ball. It comes to a round fry. We have an opening goal. Piatti, the architect, and the finish from Matteo Mancozu. A little bit of run in behind, just comes off the shoulder of Roman Torres. Excellent job of rounding Stefan Fry. And then once he's got around the goalkeeper, it's the simplest to finish once again. Well, the warning signs are there for all to see with Piatti. Now Morris at the other end. He's got it between the two central defenders off the outside of the woodwork. The closest we've come to a leveler. And once again, the pace of Jordan Morris absolutely terrifying the Montreal central defenders. Piatti trying to break forward. He's got to run out wide of him. Piatti going out. Torres continues to go. Still has it. Goes all the way. It's a superb individual effort from Ignacio Piatti. And Montreal impact have doubled the lead. 2 0. One little mistake, one little turnover, just caught in possession. And this Montreal Impact team is on the break with that man, Ignacio Piatti. He has options out wide. He doesn't need them. He creates a little space for himself. And he absolutely just hammers it past Stefan Fry, who's shielded by the body of Chad Marshall. The ball played out wide, looking for Svensson. Ladero tries to play in Svensson. He gets it back. Svensson, the ball inside the six-yard box. Jovan Jones has it. Can he go for goal? He pulls it back in the effort. Screwed well over the crossbar. 27 years of age. Double of caps for Canada as well. Neil Fisher coming forward. Is that a free kick? It's a penalty. The referee has pointed to this spot. Laurel Seaman cannot believe it, but a lifeline for the Seattle Sounders. So this is excellent job from O'Neill Fisher, just taking defenders on. Look, that's a foul. That's a foul inside the box. Simon has nothing to... Look, he comes across, he blocks Fisher, he knocks him over. Ladero against Bush. Ladero, cool as you like, into the bottom corner, sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. And the Sounders, despite not having many chances, are right back in this one at 2-1. Four options inside the area. Wingo arriving late, the cross towards the far post. Morris, it does fall! Will Bruce got the leveler! From 2-0 down, Sounders have stolen a point on the road! Look at Roldan, where is the outside back? Roldan creates the space, puts the ball in the box, and look at all the Sounders jerseys in there. They're unable to clear their lines, it falls to Will Bruin, and Will Bruin just hammers it in from four yards. He opens his account and the Sounders absolutely steal a point on the road. Montreal under pressure and Montreal folded. First it's a veteran in Simon with a silly challenge on Fisher. The big scoreboard that until about 15 minutes or so ago read 2-0 Montreal Seattle with a stunning comeback. It all started with the penalty kick.